Let's talk. That's what it's called. We? We're calling <laughs> Let's Talk. And in the studio today, Stephen Hurwitz is not here. He's usually here with us, our co-host Stephen. Uh, he is off traveling around, going to some big party in Florida or somewhere. Uh, but with us is Shelley Rugg. Hello. Charles Schultz. Yes. And myself, Paul Raphael. Just the three of us in the studio this week. And that fly. There's a fly. Uh, in and the a fly, yes. yes. Uh, Renfield. Renfield. <laughs> um, <laughs> Stephen's with us in spirit. <laughs> so, oh, he's on. I'd just like to... Actually, uh, my, you know, the late Donna Sheehan used to, every time she saw a fly, she goes, oh, there's my mum. <laughs> <laughs> She's oh. back. Um, anyway, oh so gosh. this week um, we're actually, because we're in Pledge Drive, we're going to talk about the importance of uh, local radio in our lives and hopefully in your lives. So first of all, let's give out the number for... Um, mm, that's interesting. I think uh, 415-663. Yes. Uh, 90050. Uh, 90050 is the pledge number. So we are in the middle of pledge week here, and uh, this is a very important one. It's the fall pledge drive. Very important. We like that. And uh, we have a goal, a, a goal of $500. You know, that's... That's just one donation, isn't it? Just, it could be. Just very call well in with 500 bucks. And we have a couple of challenge grants coming up so for $100 each. So, um, you know, if, you give, uh, if we get $100, it will be doubled. And uh, the second $100 will also be doubled. So there it is. It's, uh, we're on our way to 500 already as soon as that begins happening. And... Um, Yes, it's uh, Pledge Drive. We have uh, premiums. We have uh, the bandana, a new design by Jaime Crespo. It's a wonderful, wonderful map for a pledge of $30. Or Calendar Club members, which is a wonderful thing, by the way. Calendar Club members. Uh, it's, a monthly, uh, it's a monthly amount taken off your credit card. You don't even feel it. <laughs> uh, and that's a, that's a good way for, uh, for the station to have reliable source of income and knowing how much is going to come in every month. So do that and increase your calendar club membership by at least $2. You could also have one of Jaime's new designs of bandana. Uh, we also have the ceramic travel mug, which is this wonderful red, bright red mug with the logo on it. That's for $50. KWMR umbrella for $50, also a great thing. And uh, the Eton, of course, for the $100 pledge, the Eton FRX1 hand turbine emergency radio. Yes. It's a well, wonderful thing now, and, and fun to play with, too. Now, uh, we've and got we some also have some real special. items. I'm just going to make some things up. <laughs> uh, for, well, th no, this is true. I, a haircut from Megan Sullivan. Uh, cut my hair, cut Elizabeth Hill's partner, uh, Lauren. I don't know Lauren's last name. Uh, so she does short, she does long, and I will talk to her about this. Uh, <laughs> well, she, you haven't actually pre arranged <laughs> No, no it, just, it occurred to me while I was on air. But a haircut from <laughs> Megan Sullivan uh, for what is that worth? Mm, $50? $50. 415-663-9050. She is a nurse practitioner, so if you have a medical emergency during the haircut, she can also help. <laughs> she can um, also save your life. That's right. $50 for a haircut from Megan Sullivan. Also, and I have some uh, uh, bona, uh, bona fide uh, old Tony's swag. So Marshall, ma special Marshall swag. This, so when they were clearing out Tony's after the, the uh, Hog Island, uh, uh, before Hog Island took it over, uh, they threw out all their colanders and bread plates, and so I snagged some of these. So for yes. $25, you can have an original Tony's bread plate. We have two. two they're designs. wonderful. They're, they're how, what are they? Bread plate, oh, about uh, eight inches across, six, six inches. A little, yeah, somewhere in there. Nice white, heavy <laughs> ceramic. A classic plates. item. And I will, I will get uh, John uh, Konotich to sign one of them for you if you, <laughs> if you want. Uh, that, but that's $50. The signed plate is $50. The, the uh, unsigned plate, $25 pledge at 415-663-9050. And for, I think we have to go to 50 for this, a colander, an original Tony's colander, colander missing a handle. Yes. Uh, and with lots of battle scars from, from many uh, decades of it's service. A, it's a beautiful piece of aluminum artwork, really. It's, I mean, uh, you could it hang it on. the a good hat, perhaps. It, 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 it fits me, actually. I tried it on this morning. <laughs> it's just the right size for me. I have an extraordinarily large head. And you could hang it on your wall and put underneath the uh, ceci, c'est pas une colombe. You what could do that? that. 
This is not a calendar. Oh, calendar. Right? Yes. Oh. <laughs> I, well, look, uh, that's right. No, it's it's a it's a it's a Marshall, Marcel Duchamp uh, yeah, exactly. uh, calendar. Yes. Um, yes, and found uh, object artwork. So you can have these things, but you have to call four one five six six three. Um, uh, Nine zero five zero. Oh, that's, that's the right. That's the pledge number. And if you'd like to, you know, um, we also want you to call us because that's what this is. It's a call-in radio show. We want to hear from our listeners, and uh, we'd like you to call in with uh, what the station, how it's affected your life, either for the good or the bad. We'll take all suggestions. We'll take all praise and all calumny. No, is that the right word? No, uh, that well, would be li- evil. Yeah, it's yeah. It's a, it's a source of lies, but I'm I'm for the lies. Call in with a lie. I like that. Um, uh, you can you call mean us. Fake news, right? Call us in the studio four one five six six three eight four nine two, or you could actually just uh, you could also make a comment to our wonderful volunteer staff out there who are waiting for your call at four one five six six three nine zero five zero, which is the pledge line. That's right. You could talk to uh, Carrie Livingston, and don't be afraid. She really is a very gentle, nice person. I know she has a reputation being a bit of a bruiser. But, uh, <laughs> thank you so much, Carrie, for working the phones. So um, what is, uh, apart from doing this every week, oh, and we're also doing, we're also basically <laughs> working in conjunction <laughs> yeah. with your show, which is on every other week and on Fridays, right. and so you're not on this week, so we're combining the local organ on the and local Livestock. organ on. But I failed to inform my mother that I was going to be on on Thursday, so I'm, uh, my one listener, I think, is uh, not going to <laughs> not going to be able to call in. And your brother. Uh, and my, although, two listeners, it's a good point. <laughs> Tell me about your show, Charles. Well, I you, haven't caught it yet. We have, we've been doing this for about five years, and it, has, it ran out of steam, you know, after the first 18 months. But um, <laughs> the, uh, no, for the last five years, I uh, do show, you know, sometimes we have guests, and actually we've had a wide variety of guests. We've had poets and you know, uh, 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 people you know from who are English, you know, uh, yeah. theorists of, of of the English language and historians and political theorists. And what's the uh, show called? The local organ on it was a local dot org radio blog, but because it had a. They, we, they needed to change the name, shorten it. And so I suggested the low.o oh, radblo, and uh, that was hmm. uh, deemed not to be acceptable. I liked it. Yes. So, <laughs> so it became the local organon, which is a reference to Francis Bacon, the English philosopher. And wow. his um, and the, the idea, organon is a Greek word. It just means a, a tool. Um, and uh, and that's what people from Greece call me. Um, the uh, and and uh, you know so we we just had you know guests on that that um, that are interested in politics and culture and history and uh, people that you know a lot of uh, sort of overlap actually with like the David Barsamian show they play before us. Um, mm. you know, a lot of the guests have been on that. We, we, we've had uh, Noam Chomsky turns me down about once a year. He's a wonderful <laughs> correspondent. Last time he turned me down, this was great. He said, I'd love to, to be on the show, but I can't because I'm on my honeymoon in Brazil. Uh, this any, is actually, any old excuse. This is like two years ago. He was 86 at the time. Wow. <laughs> uh, so, uh, so, but anyway, yeah, was, uh, who, uh, uh, Helen Caldicott, we called her yeah. in Australia. That yeah, was yeah. great. Um, I remember that. Uh, Walter Ben Michaels, um, uh, the professor of English at uh, UIC. Um, good Lord. Uh, um, Bill Black, the guy uh, who wrote The Best Way to Rob a Bank is to Own One. Uh, who sees on uh, Leo Panich, the, the editor of the Socialist Register. Um, we have it's a great show. It's a, it's a, it's a, we have uh, gr- wonderful guests. It's always very inspiring and uh, educative. And, uh, <laughs> and I'm even allowed to come on. Uh, again, I, so. Well, fabulous contribution. We have lots of Paul, Paul Elmore. Paul Elmore, of course, Paul the uh, the ex mayor, the mayor emeritus, emeritus, yeah. mayor emeritus. Uh, and well, he, he writes. Marshall. Uh, Paul Elmore writes a new essay almost every show, which he which he reads out, which are great. And I think we'll end. Apologize those at some point. We'll probably mm. do it like a print-on-demand book. Maybe next Pledge Drive, you can buy all of the, the uh-huh. essays of uh, Paul Elmore for a, a donation. But this this time, we have Megan Sullivan haircut in her backyard in Point Reyes <laughs> Station. That's Does, 50 bucks. I just have a question. Does Megan know about this? No, no not, not at all. <laughs> she, she cut my hair there. But I, it's, I auctioned off things. I auctioned off a date with Paul once, and I didn't <gasps> tell him. Oh. Um, so oh, do. and and for... Nobody a, called a for that one. That's true. Right. No, somebody, <laughs> somebody did. You stood the up. $200 oh, you can go out with Charles. <laughs> yes, exactly. And do. then we'll have our, you know, challenge grant met. 
Oh, we do have a challenge. George we and do. Sherry Clyde yes. have, have pledged hundred dollars in an anonymous, no doubt, an admirer of me. Uh, an anonymous uh, challenge of $100. So if we get to $100, we meet one ch- uh, challenge grant, we get the other $100. Yes. The other. So that would add up to 400 if only that could happen. Yes. And every, we, you know, we don't, it doesn't just have to be just uh, high rollers. All we want is uh, anything, anything you can <laughs> afford to, uh, to give to the station because this is an important resource in uh, in West Marin and beyond West Marin because we're heard up and down all over the place actually up the coast down the coast in the city Through the over internet. the hills yeah. over the dales <laughs> far away <laughs> yeah yes. and if you want to <sighs> donate call 415-663-9050 even if you don't want to if you just feel obligated <laughs> Do so exactly. right now. No, no I'm five six six three nine zero five zero. And uh, I got to tell you, two bread plates from Tony's. Twenty five dollars. You get a bread plate for twenty five dollars, and the colander, a special one handled, uh, a broken down colander. Well from, used. From yes, from t- Tony's, an original item. But the holes, the holes in it still work. Though. The holes in it still work, and it has <laughs> extra holes where the other handle used to be attached. So it's actually a better colander. Um, <laughs> and as I say, it's a it's a wonderful helmet. It is also uh, a helmet. It's, it's good for wearing on windy days. Uh, indeed. When the, when the branches Maybe you are could flying. Use it to form your paper mache. No, we have, we have donated with the lovely. We have a donation. Here. Thank you, David Clarkson, or uh, our, one of our one of our loyal listeners. And Thank another mayor so emeritus of Marshall. Actually. Exactly. Yeah. Until he was, until he left. Oh, you I mean, oh, he, was wasn't, he wasn't thrown out of town. He wasn't run out of town on a rail. That but, was well, somebody else. But I uh, think David, you need to call in and defend <laughs> these charges. Were you <laughs> run out of Marshall? Um, Thank you, David. And uh, take an example from your local jeweler, Point Reyes jeweler, David Clarkson, and uh, give us a call four one five six six three nine zero five zero because uh, we just need a little bit more to get to. Uh, get to one of our challenge grants for $100. So we need some more made-up things. Uh, it's not made up. You will get that haircut with Megan Sullivan, I promise you, for a $50 <laughs> pledge. Uh, that is real. Um, what else? So is the colander, and so are the plates. Is the colander these, and the plates these are real? These two bread plates, they're, they're perfect for dinner parties. Yeah, I, they're fabulous. For <laughs> serving petit fool. If you want a, a real piece of West Marin history, these are original Tony's uh, bread plates uh, that, that you can have. And if you pay for an extra $25, I will get one signed by John Konotich. Uh, somehow. Somehow. <laughs> we'll go over to John's place and get him to sign it. I would do my John Connodish impersonation, but... No, no, not, no, 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 no. Don't do that. You'll oh, blow right, the, bad you'll, jokes. You'll okay. blow out the mic. We're going to tell bad jokes. That's a good point. We'll tell bad jokes until somebody calls. So oh, call at 415-663-8492 to talk about what local radio means to you. 415-663-9050 to make a donation. Okay. Yes. So my brother married a woman with two heads. You ask, is she pretty? Well, yes and no. Uh, uh, the, uh, uh, what, more bad jokes? Well, you? I'm interested in what Shelley, uh, how the radio has changed Shelley's life, or for the better or the worse. Do tell, <laughs> Shelley. Uh, uh, well, you know, I, I, I moved here from the city, and... You know, we have radio out there, but nothing ha. quite like this. <laughs> and Pish tosh. and uh, I, I just, it, for me, it's it's one of the charms of the community is this radio station and the involvement of members of the community bringing so min- so much diversity to this uh, this program, this radio station, and um, and the opportunity to sit here behind the mic. <laughs> Big green microphone, <laughs> you know, it's it's kind of a kick. It's fun. Yeah, it is, isn't it? Yeah, and and you know, uh, people might not realize that this radio station actually is, is my father's radio station because his initials are KWR. Those were his father's mm. initials. His mother's initials MR. So certainly, this is his radio there station. There you are. He actually came in uh, to claim the radio station during a pledge drive one year and ended up making a $50 donation. Fabulous. <laughs> so uh, we, we, you can have the radio station for $150. How's that? <laughs> well, <laughs> oh, yes. A pledge for $150. This can be your station. Uh, but, you know, I think the, 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 the WCBM, the, the station I was on in college in Ann Arbor, 
Um, so I was thrown off for being an obnoxious brat, which obviously I've changed. Oh, that's an idea. Nothing additionally, <laughs> really. Um, the, uh, and, but anyway. I didn't uh, know we had that option. That's interesting. Well, I, I, I barred all the doors uh, to the studio open, to the whole building, actually, invited the homeless of Ann Arbor to take over the airwaves. It's an interesting <laughs> story I can tell off air for $10, a pledge of $10. <laughs> I will tell you the story of how I got thrown off the air. Meet you at the Western. But, oh, yes, yes. Uh, so um, I was at the Western last night. Wonderful, uh, wonderful, wonderful gossip. We'll have to. Oh, oh yes. wonderful let's, gossip. For a pledge of $15, I, I will <laughs> gossip with you. Uh, all of the most delicious West Marin gossip, I will give you $15. There are, there are so many pledge items now that uh, you may, be tr- may have trouble keeping track. And, in fact, the phone volunteer may not even know what these other pledges are. But if you, uh, if you call now, 415-663-9050, and say, hey, I want the Tony's Brand artifact. Plate. Yes. The artifact from Tony's. Yes. The plate or the colander. The colander whose holes still work. The exactly. holes are in working condition. I right? checked all 73 of them this morning. The yes. holes are in pristine condition. The rest of it, not so much. Ooh. But that's how you know it's real. Does it still have its little feet? Uh, no little feet. feet. Oh. <laughs> no, 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 they don't use feet. No, um, it doesn't have feet. It just uh, it just kind of sits there and rolls back and forth. It's interesting to watch, actually. It's, uh, it could be used as an earthquake monitor. Oh. Ah, yeah. Sit right. this sit this on your dining table, and if there's a little tremor, you'll know because the colander will go. Lang, lang. <laughs> so listen in, folks. It's not just a colander. It's not just a helmet. It is also an earthquake uh, early warning detector and a work of art. And a work of art. And a work of art. And we have a call. Look at that. We have a call. <laughs> With I think it was a description of the colander that exactly. attracted them. Caller, you're on the air. What's your name, please? Please watch your language. What would you like to know about the colander? This is Sally. <laughs> <laughs> That doesn't count. <laughs> Does it? Counts for everything in my book. Oh, gracious. Oh. No. no, I'm sorry. I'm <laughs> <laughs> Suddenly it all went dead. Uh, more of his declaration. I count on is that you'll be chased off the air by Charles. <laughs> in a very pleasant way. No, I'm, I'm just a fan of the show uh, because I like how how rigorous you have to prepare. It's mm. clearly a show that requires a great deal of study and thought. And the topics are always interesting. So I'm cheerleading for Let's Talk. Well, thank you. That's wonderful. And you're not biased in any way. Uh, <laughs> can we, can we, uh, can we say that? Uh, I'm yeah. completely objective. I was uh, <laughs> actually checking yesterday, and I printed out the list of the topics that we've covered in 115 programs now. And uh, everything from end-of-life decisions to Zika virus. Remember that when that was a Babies, problem? yes or no. That was a great uh, show. Oh. Relationships, masculinity, sex. Uh, oh, the circumcision show. That was a good one. And the uh, the ranking, vaccin- yeah. vaccination show, oh, that which, was a great uh, one. which garnered more calls from all over the country than any others, partly due to some... Uh, Rating the super hunks of West Marin. You remember some, that one? Uh, fixing of the uh, telephone lines. Uh, walking the dog, yes. We had one about kittens, puppies, and other distractions. That was also um, popular. Sexual <laughs> harassment not long ago. Libertarianism, mental illness. I mean, we cover the, we cover the gamut. 115 topics in as many weeks. Oof. That's a lot of... Uh, yeah, thank you, Sally. That's true. There's a lot of, uh, a lot of research going on about some of these. Uh, 663-9050. Please make a donation now. Uh, Carrie Livingston's threatened to break my legs if I to come out of the studio without a bag of money for <laughs> Kate Mara. And she means business, let me tell you. Um, Sally, are you still there? Oh. oh, yes. Oh, oh, oh sorry. Oh, sorry. <laughs> the thing is, I just saw Sally, so she is hiding somewhere in the studio. I'm skulking. Yeah, skulking. Yeah, that's right. But I show. do want to encourage people to call because uh, if you're too uh, uh, frightened or you're too busy to uh, get involved in the conversation, you're always able to avail yourself of listening in on the conversation, and that is a great value uh, to all, and mm. the way to really uh, impact in a proactive way is to call the pledge line and show your support f- for the the fact that this show is so. And this it's a brave show, I think. Four one five six six three nine zero five zero nine zero five zero. 
And we have a... Oh, wonderful. We have a... Uh, a new Calendar Club member, Cynthia Harland. Thank you, Cynthia. What a wonderful thing. That's lovely. And, uh, yes, keep pledging people. Keep calling in. 415-663-9050 is the number. Did we, make, did we make one of our challenge grants? The lovely Meow? Will you tell us? Yes, oh, we, we did. did. Oh, Look at that. Excellent. Yeah. So Thank there you, we Cynthia. go. Thank you, Cynthia. And now we have one more from George and, uh, and Sherry Clyde. Actually, George and Sherry, if you could call in to make your own challenge grant, <laughs> that would be a huge help to us. Um, but, yeah, George and Sherry Clyde of Marshall. George is uh, the longtime secretary of the East Shore Planning Group and was on KWMR KW Mar for a long time. And mm -hmm. is, uh, he used is, to do the news on KWMR. That's, that's that right. Uh-oh. Oh. oh. Hello, oh. Sally. Are you gone? Just as well. Sally's, Sally's <laughs> gone. <laughs> She, she, just, she just gave the, I'm out. She just appeared she at the door. She just dropped the phone. Which be, oh, <laughs> indeed, indeed. <laughs> okay, so two bread plates from Tony's, uh, $25 each, and the, the, the Colander Club. Join the Colander Club. The uh, Colander Club. <laughs> you can have this uh, uh, beaten-up old colander from Tony's Kitchen, the original Tony's, uh, for a pledge of $50. Yeah. Uh, also, Tony's you, Seafood, this is. If you, in case you don't know what Tony's is, it's not just some guy's house. <laughs> it's Tony's Seafood <laughs> Restaurant. <laughs> In Marshall, which uh, which has undergone extensive renovations and uh, new management, so uh, it's a wonderful place. It's a lovely. Uh, we have uh, a local. We call it Locals Night. Um, every Friday, there's music yeah, every Friday. Locals, it's yeah. lovely. It's lovely, and uh, people are starting to turn out for that again. It's good because they brought back the three dollar pints. And let me just say thank you, <laughs> John and Terry. I was going to burn the place down, but you brought the three dollar pints back. Three dollar pints gonna, of beer. Yeah. There you go. There it is. Um, so yes, we have. Have lots of other premiums, maybe not as interesting to you as an, an, an old colander and a couple of used bread plates. But uh, there's the bandana, the travel mug, the umbrella, and the emergency radio for various pledges from $30 up to $100. So the more you give, the more you get. And remember, I stole uh, one of the napkins from the Valley Fort Hotel, which is basically just a bandana. It's a kind of cutesy, cloying thing, and I can say that because they're in Sonoma County. They don't count. Um, the, uh, it's, you could have that bandana, which has a specific history. Mm. Uh, it's in my car right now. Um, I've got some old maps of the East Bay. that will be $60 <laughs> for an old map of the East Bay. Oh, old, those are historic maps. They are historic maps yeah. from the 1920s. You can have yeah. a map of Los Angeles. That'll be 100 bucks for a map of Los Angeles from the 1920s. <laughs> a haircut from Megan Sullivan. everyone's keeping track of this. <laughs> are you writing these down? <laughs> a haircut from Megan Sullivan. That's $50. Um, and uh, let's see. See. Oh, and I, I get her haircuts. Uh, Elizabeth Hill, uh, who's uh, seven days past, I guess eight days now. She's going to have a baby any second. Overdue. Mm. Uh, but she cuts uh, her partner's hair as well. And uh, so lots of people getting haircuts from Megan Sullivan around, complimented on the haircut, uh, mostly by bald men. Um, <laughs> the, uh, uh, but, you know, it's, it's, it's an excellent, uh, excellent uh, item that you could have. So stolen bandana. Uh, <laughs> two bread plates from Tony's. Join the Colander Club for the original <laughs> Tony's Colander. Uh, a, hair, a haircut from Megan, um, and what do we have? And a hand crank radio. Hand crank radio, Jaime Crespo's new design of a bandana, ceramic travel mug, umbrella, and, of course, the radio, yes. And, we have uh, a caller. Look at we this. We have a caller. Another caller. <laughs> Hello, caller. You're on the air. Keep it clean, please. It's Creta. 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 Hello. Yes. N not I want to call in and say how much I appreciate West Marin Community Radio. Oh, wonderful. Well, you are, you are an Think active the participant thereof. I'm sorry? You're an active participant therein and thereof. Yes, I am. Mm -hmm. And in what fact, is the name of my your... Show this my show this morning brought in a caller from Texas with a pledge. Good uh -huh. heavens. Wait a minute. Wow. Yes, it's true. Hmm. <laughs> how can we? How can we um, outdo Competition. that? Competition. That with the Colander Club. <laughs> the col <laughs> <laughs> Look, do you want the Colander or not? <laughs> <laughs> I'm not calling in on the pledge for this one. Oh, oh. mistake! On the well, radio no. program for this one. So, um, so the radio station, local radio, is important to you. It's oh made my it, gosh, yes. Yeah. I mean, look at all the. Um, Important topics that come across the airwaves here. Mm -hmm. Things that need to be discussed, things that don't need to be discussed. <laughs> things that, well, let's say, lightly need to be discussed. 
Yeah. Well, great. Well, we like to uh, we like to mix it up a little bit. Every every so often we throw in a topic that's uh, less serious than some of the others, but mostly it's about and, and really it shouldn't be about us chatting away about all these subjects. It's supposed to be listeners like you calling in and uh, and giving us the benefit of your knowledge. This is well, the, the collective wisdom. Too. What's that? It's the music, too. Oh, yes. Oh. Uh, the music, yes. Only a few of those. On, uh, yes, on the air. I mean, uh, KWMR, wonderful, wonderful thing. And also emergence, part of the emergency system here. We're uh, Broadcast network, uh-huh. An integral part of that. Uh, we have the com that's van that can, that can be anyway. Oh. That's, no? that's why we exist, because we're an emergency broadcast network for West Marin. Yeah. No, it's a very important. It's a little jewel. I mean, you drive around, you drive very far out of range of KWMR, and you find out there's not many stations like that around. There's, mm, you know, KZYX, I guess. KZYX would be the next one up the coast. K-Mud, I suppose. But, uh, yeah. Oh, cows. But they're few and, few and far between. And cows. <laughs> so now we're just going to list like 90 of them. <laughs> but, uh, and remember the, you know. Um, Someone probably has them all memorized. In <laughs> well, there's that one in the Ukiah. I forget what that is. It and fits the calendar, you know. That's right. Who wants this calendar? Calendar, original Tony's calendar. <laughs> Caller, do you want the calendar? Caller, do you want to join the calendar club? <laughs> I already am a member of the calendar club. Uh, wow. <laughs> Gracious. That's the I have three, and they all three fit my head. Uh, but, <laughs> but none like this one. But maybe you have a friend who needs a colander for their head. Have you thought about that? <laughs> this is a classic. A yes, classic a classic colander. A classic colander from the Colander Club. I love listening to your program. It gives me the impetus to keep my day going. Oh, oh nice thank you. So thank what's you that freedom. worth to you in terms of cash? <laughs> uh, <laughs> I'm bringing dinner tonight. From, uh, 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 415-663-9050 is the pledge line. Well, Crater, thank you. I have to do the uh, yes, you do the half-hour announcements. But thank you so much for calling. It was lovely. You're very welcome. All righty. Can I do them in the voiceover voice? Come on, let me do the announcements. Okay, not you can't do it too wackily, but well, yes, <laughs> just in, in good radio announcer voice. <laughs> Old time radio, let's see. KWMR is supported by our listener members and by to celebrate life, Breast Cancer Foundation raising funds to help underserved women and men living with breast cancer through its Bay Area Breast Cancer Grants Program. The foundation supports nonprofits that provide direct and emergency services and believes that no one should face breast cancer alone. Information about how to get involved is available at to celebrate. Greatlife.org. And support is also provided by... Uh, although KWR's radio broadcasts and internet signals are free for listeners, it does cost money to operate this radio station. In fact, it costs approximately $1,000 per day to run KWMR. $1,000 a day. And that's just the dr drugs. Um, the volunteer pro board, the one full-time and five part-time staff, and over 95 devoted programmers as well as underwriters and other volunteers make it all possible. Why don't you join KWMR as a member today? either at the annual mem membership rate of $30 a year or as a calendar club member. Thank you. Or, or a calendar club member. I don't know. Ah, yes. And support for Katie Bumar uh, is also provided by the Inverness Park Market. Information at 415-663-1491 or online at InvernessParkMarket.com. Excellently oh. read. Wow. So, uh, there you go. I'm that blown was... away by your <laughs> skills. <laughs> it was so impressive. It was like but next time, do your little right marble in the mouth warm up. Oh, yeah, it wasn't. Get it wasn't a little yeah. more fluidity in there. Everybody's yeah. a critic. Ah, <laughs> well, you know. <laughs> you just wanna, trying to, you, you know. Call help in. You That's why they don't call in, Shelley, because they're afraid to be judged <gasps> by you. Oh, no. <laughs> yeah. Old Judgy Shelley, oh, they please, say. Please, please. No, no, I've heard it privately. I only do that to Charles. Everybody only does it to Charles. It's a theme in West Marin. Anyway, four. 415-663-8492 to join us on air or 415-663-9050 to give us money. And you can also just approach us directly on the street with cash, and I will make sure that that money gets back. Oh, to yes. Yeah. Don't give uh, it to Because he's trustworthy. Anybody. Exactly. Um, and this is KWMR, of course, 90.5 Point Race Station, 89.9 Bolinas, and 92.3 in San Geronimo Valley, streaming live and archiving at kwmr.org, cable casting on Horizon Cable Channel 47. Horizon Cable has been there right since the beginning. Mm -hmm. Before we were KWMR, we were WMCR, West Marine Community Radio, and we were only on Horizon. Uh, so and you get cable we, out here. There's a channel that will play. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. It's, it's it's on TV, but it's just a it's just audio with a 
just a picture there. I think they used to run the schedule by with us in the background. <laughs> and uh, that's how many of us got our start in uh, doing this radio thing in the broom closet down at the green, red, green barn down the road. <laughs> uh huh. Were you involved from the get go, yeah. Paul? Yeah. Oh, yes. yeah. How about you, Charles? Uh, no. No, uh, no he's, not he's a newcomer. Uh, uh, yes, uh, an Erviste. Uh, the well, no, well, I, but I think we need to do animal call letters. I think this is long overdue. It's a great bumper sticker idea. I've given it to everybody at the station. They have not followed up on this. But so, what would we be? Coot, whale, yes, coot. mermaid, uh, raccoon. Uh, that would be great. Just simple. Those symbols. That's coot. a great bumper sticker. Mm, kestrel, I think. Kestrel. Yes, coot would whiskey, be a C. Uh, kestrel. Uh-huh. Uh, whale, mermaid. Raccoon. Mermaid. Mermaid. Well, it's <laughs> cryptozoology. <laughs> there are like four shows on the station about cryptozoology. Manatee. Man- oh. Ah. This is not. Be- <laughs> That's ridiculous. <laughs> well, uh, funnily enough, Coot was one of the uh, one of the call signs that was considered when we were K-O-T. first starting. Yeah. Well, yes. And uh, anyway, here we are, KWMR, and uh, we are in, in desperate need, as always. As you heard, we're, it costs about $1,000 a day. And considering that there's just a, a handful of people who are minimally paid to, uh, to work here, uh, the rest of the involvement in the station is all voluntary, and uh, a lot of people give up a lot of time to uh, fill the airwaves with wonderful programming. So... It's time to, time to pony up. Time, time, time to, to water to, the camel. Come and on, we, and we need. Uh, we have a challenge grant going. We have uh, George and Sherry Clyde. We have George and Sherry Clyde's hundred dollar challenge grant. So if we get another hundred dollars, that gets doubled, and we almost make our pledge goal of five hundred dollars for this show. So please, please show your support. If if not for us, for the station, <laughs> and of course you can donate. You can donate any time online as well. Uh, just go online if you don't want to. Uh, don't want to talk to anybody or have a nice chat with who is it? Carrie out there? Carrie Gary Livingston. Livingston. Scary Carrie. Um, Watch out. Black Jack Carrie. They call it. <laughs> uh, if you if uh, if you just want to do it online, if you're somewhere where you can do that, please. Do it. In fact, do it while you're driving. No, no, don't do that. gracious. Six six three um, nine zero five zero. We need your money. Four one five six six three nine zero five zero. The station depends on these pledges to uh, to make it through the year, and uh, it's an important resource. I think I will for commit all of us. an act of vandalism of your choosing somewhere in West Marin uh, <laughs> for a pledge of uh, one hundred and three dollars. Three one hundred and three dollars. I will. I don't know. Break out a window. How about that? One hundred and three dollars. Isn't there a special word for that? I I don't remember. <laughs> Vandalism. No, no, the actual breaking of a window. There's a there's a word. Oh, uh, I see it in sheriff's calls. Exfenestration. <laughs> uh, um, oh. I don't know. I don't know what that or, was. Hmm. What was it? Ooh. Oh well, I don't remember. Other so. than breaking and entering, I don't know. What I was hoping that you all would remember, but or know, and mm, that didn't know. happen. So. If you know what that is, call in. Call in. <laughs> call in. If you'd like to uh, tell us how KWMR has uh, made your life a wonderful thing or a terrible thing, and you somehow you can't just can't turn off the radio because you're absorbed by the voices that you hear and the music that you hear, but secretly you 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 just can't stand it anymore. But you could, uh, you could give us a call. I have another, and pledge we'll item. explain yeah. why you're why you're so wrong about I, that. Another but pledge. Everyone item. needs this this station and uh, this show in particular. Ha! Well, uh, well, there you are. I my mother sent me in the mail uh, uh, an early uh, uh, edition of a Buckminster Fuller book, not realizing that I loathe Buckminster Fuller. I think he's a con man, but he's very popular out here in West Marin. And the book can be yours for a pledge of thirty eight dollars. It's no. in, I've but got if it they could do no. 40, we'd 40. get our second matching oh, Right, so it's got to right. be 40 to 50. Oh. And you will get this Buckminster. <laughs> it's kind of cool. I mean, I think he's a fraud, but it's kind of cool book. So. No. Uh, you, can have, you can have it. It's here mm. at the station. So, colander from Tony's, bread plates from Tony's, <laughs> to haircut from Megan Sullivan, a bandana I stole from the Valley Ford Hotel. Uh, what else do we have? A hand crank radio. Um... Anything else? A date. A date with Shelley Rugg. Shelley, you sing? Oh. <laughs> no, 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 no. no. <laughs> Come on. Last time, last time I went on a date when I wasn't single, it was with Weird Al Yankovic. <laughs> that is, and you've been holding out this well, story. Man. Why? Uh, you and Weird Al? Or, um... Yeah, yeah. Well, he was one of my mom's students in high school. Uh-huh. And um, 
go on. Yeah. Mom set us up on the date. She said, wanted you to and date Weird he Al. he picked me up at my boyfriend's house. <laughs> <laughs> and why did you tell your boyfriend? He didn't get the, uh, didn't get the memo on that one, apparently. Oh, anyway. There it is. Well, that's Weird Al for you. Yeah. So there you are. That's the kind of Classic information tale. you get on this radio station. <laughs> Shelly's been on a date with Weird Al. Was, did you like it? He's kind of weird. <laughs> You know, a little known fact about Weird Al is he could stand on one leg and put his ankle behind his neck and hop around. (laughs) (laughs) While playing the accordion. Probably, yeah. (laughs) Talented, (laughs) talented guy. A talented man, indeed. Yeah. Making America laugh for a long time now. Um, So, yes, do call, please, the pledge line. Make a little little donation, won't you? Or join our calendar club. That's a wonderful thing to join. And join the calendar club to get a colander, I think. The calendar club. So it's 4156 9050 is the pledge line, and we have uh, Carrie Livingston, who was on the previous uh, program, waiting patiently for the phone to ring, and we hope it does. We just need another, just another little bit of money to get up to our second challenge grant. <laughs> I've got and another. Then, okay. then we'll double our money because uh, that's what, how what that works. Left? What do we need? How much do we need this? Forty hour? bucks. We need forty, and we're done. No, well, no, no. The, go. Oh, well, that's we're just never for the done. second challenge. We need two hundred and forty. Okay, for two hundred and forty dollars, yeah, we need, we need uh, thousands of dollars. So just write a check for thousands of dollars. <laughs> for for, for two hundred and forty dollars, I'll stop doing my Friday show until Christmas. How about that? Two hundred forty dollars, oh, I will be off the air. Wait, let me check my wallet. <laughs> Paul, we need that money later. <laughs> Come on, you know the Western doesn't take credit cards. <laughs> Found that out last night. Ah, uh, yes. Bob Giacomini bought me a lot of drinks. How about that? That, I thought that was great. That's very nice. nice well, I'm going to I'm going to throw this out there uh, for any animal lovers, any pet lovers. I will do a pet portrait. Ooh. For it. Oh, and if this they, is... if somebody calls in before twelve with a two hundred dollar donation, a pet portrait from Shelley, who specializes in pet portraits. <laughs> yeah. Pet portraits. The yes. club. This is uh, this is your profession. You're offering your professional services. Is That's there, right. Is there a website Excellent. that can see your stuff at? Yes, shellyrug.com. S H E L L E Y R U G G. G G. Excellent. So well, that's can... a very generous. See, where else can you find that? Uh, we have a very abusive caller calling, apparently. What is this? Uh, uh, somebody called Amanda from Olima. Can't believe you haven't been kicked off the air yet, is what uh, <laughs> the message is. And uh, <laughs> well, but we'd like days. to thank her for her lovely donation. That's wonderful. Um, yes. We need 20 bucks to make our 20 challenge 20 bucks grant. to make a second challenge grant and, uh, you know, another 100 to make our goal. And then beyond that, we'll take anything you've got. We'll take everything. We'll... Pet portrait from Shelly Rugg, $200. Uh, uh, quite yes. a discount, I would imagine. Uh, but uh, And you can see her pet portraits at ShellyRug.com. That's a wonderful thing. Absolutely. They, if you haven't seen them, uh, they can go to your website. Or you've put some up on Facebook, I think. Oh, uh, yeah. And, Facebook, uh, Instagram. Yeah. Yeah. And they're lovely. They're very colorful. Yes, they're colorful. Yeah. And I like the, color. And, uh, and lively. But what a lovely way to commemorate your pet. I know several pet owners who need to have this done. So for only $200, Shelley is offering to paint a portrait of your dog, cat, what? Or canary, guinea pig, yeah. Any guinea goldfish. Pig. Goldfish, sure. Yeah, there you go. The sky's the limit. Your your pet uh, uh, pill bug. <laughs> Gracious. <Really? laughs> wood lice. Yeah. I do, I do enjoy mouse. yeah insects and uh, mm. other things as well. There you are. There's a, there's a challenge. There's a, uh, a premium that was worth more than $200 and yet. There it is. So, yes, tell the, tell the phone volunteer, Carrie Livingston, tell her when you call with your pledge for $200 that that's what you desire. And uh, somehow it will as be arranged. As long as you call by noon. Got to call by noon. Got to call by noon. You this, have... All these de- deals expire. 19 minutes. minutes. Yeah. 18 minutes and two seconds. It's ticking, it's ticking away. Uh, 415-663-9050. And if you just want to uh, talk to us... Ha, 
It'll cost you. <laughs> First call 9050 and then call 415-663-8492 to let us know that you've pledged if you feel like doing that and uh, and also to let us know how you like KWMR, what local radio means to you. Have you ever have you lived elsewhere where there was nothing but automatic FM and AM stations playing automatic nonsense all day or pushing their own agendas pushing yeah. their right wing agenda thing i mean that's taking over you know one over. of the things when i when i first moved to this community um you know the idea of uh, think imagining a radio show is is mm. kind of a fun uh thing to to imagine mm. what would i what would i do if i had my own show on kwmr I'm I'm close. I'm getting close. Ah. <laughs> getting so, used to the on-air thing now. Oh, so now we need to do a little naming and shaming. Who Uh-oh. tells us that they listen to this show and has not called in? I blame you, Richard Kirschman. <laughs> <laughs> I know well, I will see you at the station house. This will become a topic of conversation. I don't see you here on the list of the members of the Calendar Club. Oh, what about oh you have a list of the members of the Calendar Club. I, I could read some, <laughs> uh, some of the names that I enjoy. Jessica Terwilliger, yes. Uh, Frank Trutman, Jr., uh, Anita Terrell Brown. But what, about, what about Doris Ober? Maybe she's on here. There's a wonderful list of uh, of all the greatest people in West Marin are on the Calendar Club. Ooh, so that would be me. Join them, won't you? <laughs> join us on the Calendar Club. And um, what is the what's the minimum for the Calendar Club? Mm, ten dollars. Seems I think. like it's about ten dollars. Uh, but you you want to make it twenty. There. You want to make it thirty. And if you're a Calendar Club member and you increase your monthly amount by at least two dollars, you can receive a lovely bandana. By Jaime Crespo, our uh, resident uh, programmer and uh, and professional cartoonist. He designed the new bandana. Yeah, it's a map it. of West Marin. Oh. Mm. Well, and, oh, I should say, D- uh, Doris Sober and Richard Gershman are members of the calendar. Of course they are. They're, they're, some still they're wonderful people. If you want to be as wonderful as all the other calendar club members, please call in 415-663- Nine zero five zero, and we have a special guest. Good day. Well, so okay, I really want to thank those people who have called. We've had four calls four so calls. far, which is really marvelous. But let's have a few more calls because there's only twenty more dollars needed to obliterate the challenge the grant challenge grant from George and Sherry Clyde and maybe obliterate is too violent a word <laughs> to you've, match. Been ta- you've been talking to Carrie Livingston haven't you yes. she's got a mouth on her whoa yes what a hussy <laughs> no she's fabulous and she's actually awaiting your calls 415-663-9050 show your support for this extraordinary show I don't know another show quite like this <laughs> on the airways and uh, <laughs> um, and that's just as well as Shelley and I give each other a knowing glance <laughs> and um, <laughs> oh but a gift from Shelley actually quite quite a, a wonderful uh, thing that you offered for Two hundred dollars, a pet portrait. People are potty yes. about their pets. Sally, and pet pet portrait. That's right. You may need to do a portrait of Stella. Ste- oh. Stella, I've, I've the wayward Stella. The, cat. Oh, <laughs> <laughs> the last Stella I painted, though, was a dog, a yeah. black and white dog. Yes. Well, the, very, it, oh. he's transitioned. It's Stella the cat now. Yeah. Anyway. Well, you see, see all of the things, the myriad of things offered here on this show. Not only really interesting, pithy, if I may use that word. Carefully, yes. <laughs> Commentary. Yes. Uh, kvetching. Kvetching. Uh, deep information about different topics every week. Every which, topic under the sun. Yeah. And now we have pet portraits. <laughs> As Shelley is a wonderful artist. So 415-663-9050. Oh, a donation, you do? a donation of out. only $200 will get you a professionally painted portrait of your pet. That's wow. a wonderful thing. Great also, that'll get us almost to the show goal, which is $500. So we need only uh, $220 to get to the show goal. Hmm. So really, this what about, would pretty much do it. What about Hannah? Would you do Hannah for somebody for a um, uh, donation? 
No, for uh, this show. <laughs> maybe for my own show. Oh! Yeah. Solidarity is the word here at KWMR. <laughs> Isn't it, though? Um, mercenary, mercenary is the word <laughs> of the moment. Uh, well, no, I have to think about that because no, now you've put me on the spot. And that's, I'm so shocked yeah. that that has happened. <laughs> oh, she's, she's, it's quite a look. Uh, All right, let's so see. I'll let you go. Th- uh, 663-9050 or go online to kwmr.org because... These numbers are in our favor. They're auspicious. One call at $200 will get us so close to the show goal. Yes. And It'll get you me. a portrait of your pet. What yeah, could absolutely. be more wonderful than that? That's a wonderful <laughs> idea. And uh, for, what was it, $50 for the colander? Yes, you can have a, 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 an original <laughs> Tony's, Tony's Seafood restaurant colander. colander. A piece $50. of history. Oh, by the way, the bread plate has been pledged for. Oh, somebody oh. bought a bread plate. Okay. How that many are available? Well, now only one. Only one bread plate left. $25 bread for the plate bread plate left. or 50 if you want it signed by John Conatich. Um, oh. And if you want me to steal something off the Conatich property, I'd be willing to do that, too, for $75. <laughs> um, He's such a cheap criminal. It's, yes, yes. Yeah, so this, uh, you, this, uh, this show, yes, 115 weeks. It's uh, wow. just over two years. Two it's quite a, a commitment, Paul. And... Uh, I mean, it's amazing. Pesticides. The UN Paris Climate Summit. We talked about that two years ago. Yeah, yeah, I remember. And no, no, no. of I course now. So, what was your matter. first show? First show was End of Life Decisions because uh, that was the year that uh, Donna moved on, and uh, so yeah, that was a, a great one to start with. Had some lovely calls on that one because it's a uh, you know it's a topic out here. We're mm-hmm. all making well, decisions at the ends of our lives. Yeah, and not just out here. I mean, that's yeah. just part of the human condition. Yeah. yeah. yeah, yeah. Um, and then, you know, well, then we have went to uh, technology, vaccines, green energy, religion, education. We've done quite a few variations on the religious <laughs> aspects of things. Uh, it's, uh, yeah, it's, we, cover, we cover topics large and local. Uh, Depending on, like, grazing on public lands. That was one we did last I year. I only do it on weekends. <laughs> grazing? <laughs> no, indeed. <laughs> Not in the elk sanctuary. Either. Now, we've got 10 minutes. We need $20. And I need one of you cheapskates out there to call in. <laughs> Six six three nine zero five zero. Way, way to whip up the. Uh, <laughs> it's good cop bad cop. You, you attract more bees with honey. It's, this is a good cop bad cop. You be nice. Oh um, okay. Right. I'll oh, be yeah. the sweetie pie. That's right. Exactly. Okay. Shelly's gonna be all sweet to you, but listen here, you punks. <laughs> Call in and give us the money. Six six three nine zero five zero. We know you were there. Uh, um, <laughs> six six three nine zero five zero indeed, and uh, we have uh, the lovely, uh, lovely volunteers waiting to take your call, and uh, and take your pledge of donation because that's what this uh, this wonderful, unique radio station relies on is our listeners' generosity, and really uh, that makes it your. Anyone who gives any money to this radio station, it is your radio station then. You, you're a part owner of it. Aha. Uh-huh. Let's hear it for socialized radio. <laughs> <laughs> whoop, All right. They, they got a lot of pumpkins in here. If somebody wants a pumpkin, call and donation at $20. I'll meet you out back at the radio station. You can have any pumpkin you want. <laughs> All right? going to steal uh, a pumpkin. I'm going to steal a pumpkin. Good grief. I know a joke that features a pumpkin, but I just you don't think it's it. appropriate. <laughs> <laughs> A not, rude pumpkin joke. Not yeah, that. Oh, yeah. For, tw- for twenty dollars after uh, twelve o'clock, <laughs> come down to Kate of Umar and, and Shelley will tell, tell you the, the joke. The yes. rude pumpkin joke. The rude Off pumpkin the air. <laughs> Who's got a rude pumpkin joke? And Halloween is coming up. This could be very <laughs> socially useful. That? Or maybe a yeah, a scary story. And Shelley has very generously offered for a two hundred dollar donation to this station to uh, to paint a portrait of your favorite pet. Isn't that a wonderful thing? We know a lot of pet owners here who are deeply dippy crazy about, dogs, yeah. about their pets. Yes. And uh, what better way to uh, commemorate them for the future? Because, you know, they are all going to pass away at some point. So <laughs> while they're still alive and in good form and looking healthy and, and, and waggy and yes. hairy, beforethedogsdead.com <laughs> is where you can uh, no. have a have a. Portrait professionally painted by Shelley Rugg. Yeah, yeah, yeah. For only a $200 donation. Yeah. Which would also 
get us over the top. So yes. please, yes. do it, won't so you? do it. Just eight minutes. You, this offer will go away after noon. That's it. That will disappear. <clears throat> yes, limited only time during the, offer. Act <laughs> limited now. Limited time only. Act now. Exactly. Only during this show is this being offered. And yes. even if you act silly, you know, it's okay. We did get rid of, oh, get rid of, we did uh, bestow a beautiful bread plate on, on one caller. We have one bread plate left, $25 one that bread Tony's plate. Seafood Classic bread plate. And the colander. In white ceramic. Yes, beautiful. And uh, the classic Tony's aluminum, aluminum, I would say, uh, colander. Yeah. Uh, with uh, with oh, holes. We got more oh, information this? With yeah. working holes. Oh, there we are. What do we got? Oh, my. Oh. Uh, well, no. Keep your colander hat. What? Keep your colander hat. Keep your colander hat. She doesn't want the says. colander? <laughs> How dare she? That was Krita, oh, who it. just called. She made oh. a donation. All right. hey, she made a donation, she but she didn't want the colander for some reason. I don't understand why. <laughs> this is, that's ridiculous. <laughs> Thank you. She wants colander. to keep your head warm, Paul. Thank you, Krita. You keep your colander hat on. Yeah. Oh, wow. Well, gracious. <laughs> keep you, that brain bucket protected. Indeed. It's it's a colander. It's a hat. It's what else is this? Uh, you, oh, it's an earthquake uh, detector. Earthquake detector. Oh, oh yeah. and it would probably be earthquake protection as exactly. well. Exactly. Exactly. It like detects the earthquake, and you immediately put it on your head. Exactly. It has one you handle on it, so you can hold, it, it, right on hold it snugly on your head by ah. the one handle it does have. Okay. <laughs> Gracious. So we did uh, call in. Is that a do- donation or just uh, That was a donation. I think there was probably a donation along with that, uh, with that insult, but uh, <laughs> <You laughs> we hope so. <laughs> I see a guy milling around out there. It doesn't seem to have much to do. Why doesn't he donate? Uh, the six six three nine zero five zero. Please, please, please. We're begging now. Yes, we are. We're begging. Please uh, call in, won't you? Please give a donation, or you can go online at any time. Of course, it, it, we're all being silly. Oh, it's got to be now. We're oh. being silly about so, being on a, on this show, but and that would be nice. And only, the pledges that we're offering that are not the official pledges for the station are only available during this, this show. show. So That's you right. have you have <laughs> hmm, about. We, Five minutes to call in and, and... Did we meet the second challenge? I don't, I don't know. know. We don't I mean, know. We got Can we... Uh, Mia, you want to... Is anyone listening in the office? Oh, yeah. no, <laughs> or have no. they turned it down like they usually do? <laughs> oh, <laughs> Why do I always feel like I'm in trouble when this happens? Uh, we well. we need the latest total. Oh, oh, and there's somebody else. Uh, uh, yeah. We've got all the blondes. It seems as if you've met... Well, it depends. The challenge what, oh, grant. Uh, oh, uh, I think you have uh, gone well beyond it. As yay! Lovely, uh, hey, hooray! Raise the roof. So your challenge grants have been met. You're only a hundred dollars from out our goal. From your goal for so, this show. I mean, really, there's five minutes left. One call at a hundred dollars. Boom. 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 Four one five six six three nine zero five zero. Let's do it. Oh, thank you Yay. so much. That was a lovely well, Sally Phillips and Mia Johnson. Mia totting up the total. Who are here like, in studio. Miguel didn't it's come like to make coffee. It's like countdown over here. Yes, it is. Five <laughs> minutes. <laughs> five minutes. Reference of five minutes to go. Um, we can do this. Absolutely. We can. There's a colander in it. There's a colander. <laughs> you could be an exclusive <laughs> member of the colander club. There were only two colanders that I salvaged from Tony's, one of them in possession of Caitlin Sullivan. I'll go even further. For $100, Caitlin Sullivan promised me one of her little fish plates. Uh, oh. You can have one of her beautiful fish plates. Perhaps you see, saw them What's at the Inverness. What's a Inver- fish plate? Well, it's at the Inverness Fair and at the Point Reyes Farmer's Market. She sells handmade ceramic plates with a fish painted on them, which are with, very attractive. Oh, so it's the, not in the shape of a fish. No. no. It's just a little it's a no, round plate. It's a nice plate. round plate that she, she makes the plates she makes themselves the plates and, and then glazes them, them yeah. them and yeah. paints them and glazes them. And it's uh, lovely. And that's nice. the cash value. I think she sells them for 25 bucks a piece. For $100, I will go and get you one because she promised me one. It was supposed to be for me. This is what I <laughs> sacrificed for this station. What are you prepared to do? 663-9050. You're a saint. Really. I, I, yes, I am a saint. That's Charles. true. Yes, saint I Charles. Oh, this is great. This is what the show should, this is what the show should always be like. <laughs> we should just this is great. Sit here and fawn. That's, ah, yes. Fawning sycophants. That's what we're calling it I want it, it to be now, believable, so. though. <laughs> I don't want any... Don't, don't, uh, don't any you do know. call in, won't you? Four one five six six three nine zero five zero, and uh, do it at any time. Yes, it's important to do it now if you want an incredible <laughs> portrait of your puppy, or yeah. if you want the colander, or if you want the bandana, or the fish plate, or the haircut, or the uh, uh, <laughs> travel mug, the umbrella, the oh, radio. Yes. I mean, we have all those official ones. I will too. steal a pumpkin Which for you. you. I will steal a pumpkin. Charles. Yes. No. 
There'll stealing be no stealing pumpkins. This stealing. is wrong. It depends on who from. Wrong. <laughs> <laughs> wrong. <laughs> well, there is a fellow here uh, uh, staring at us. Ah. Well, call in. He's, he's ready to assume his duties. It's, uh, coming up next is attunement with Anthony Wright. So, and it's live. Live, live. attunement. So, in brief, this is actually quite, quite an item. It's going to disappear as of noon, and that is just in a few minutes. $200 for your pet portrait done by Shelley Rugg. That, I think, is quite cool. Well, thank and you, I Charles. think lots of people would go be, would be you know, wild I, for that. I would think this is a, an... Uh, an unbearable thing to let slip. You have two and a half minutes to call in. <laughs> We're going to sign off pretty soon to allow uh, Anthony to come in and set up. But uh, you have two and a half minutes to call in and pledge $200 and get a portrait of your pet by Shelley Rugg. Absolutely. Fantastic. Mm, Fantastic. Anyway, thank you, everybody. Really, we appreciate everyone who called and everyone who donated today. That's a wonderful thing. Coming up next, attunement and... We'll see you next week with some topic <laughs> that we hope will interest you. Okay. Bye-bye. Thank you, everybody.